week I was introduced to the chief of security from the Kennedy Space Center. He said, I, I was in the blast bunker at the bottom of the launch site in what they call the rubber room. And it was 10 minutes before launch and the phone rang and he said, it was a bomb threat. And somebody said, there's a bomb on board the vehicle. And he said, I determined that it wasn't gonna be a real bomb scare because he said there was no way anybody could get in and I didn't think our own guys would do it. So uh, he said, let it go. Anyway, 35 seconds into the flight, as it passed through the clouds, there was this bright flash of light and a big crack and bang sound. I don't know what happened here. We had everything in the world drop out. And the next thing Charlie heard was, was Pete Conrad saying that they just lost the entire in-flight computer. Fuel cell lights and AC bus light, fuel cell disconnect, AC bus overload, one and two, main bus A and B out. And it was, in fact, lightning strike. But Charlie said it was the longest three minutes of his life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're all organized again, Jack. We've had a couple of cardiac arrests down here, too, Pete. There it is! Son of a gun! Right down the middle of the road!